Good morning, folks. Welcome to another week of streams, although this week might... This week might not have a Saturday stream. Depends, because Sunday I'm going to be very busy with work things. Good morning, Cloudy Dear. Thank you so much. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Hopefully you're doing well today. Um, we're starting a, a new... It's actually a new game, <laughs> and it's a new Dragon Quest game for me, too, so we're, it's both. Woo! Uh, yeah, we're going to be starting Dragon Quest Treasures today. It's a side game. I just woke up. Well, thank you very much for um, just showing up like that, you know? Like, it, I know that's not the first thing I think of when I wake up, but uh, yeah, we're starting a Dragon Quest Treasures this morning. It's a side game, so it's not purely like indicative of the rest of the Dragon Quest series, but it should be a good time anyway. It looked really cute whenever I was like they were showing off all like the stuff pre release and I was like, you know what? Playing we're gonna play that after DQ eight, which we finished last week. But yeah, when we starting Dragon Quest Treasures this morning. Yeah, side game's gonna be good too. I mean I'm sure you're very well aware of like all the Yu Gi Oh games. There's like ten million like just different Yu-Gi-Oh games that are, like, not specifically, like, oh, this is the GX game, or this is the, like, Duel Monsters game, you know, etc. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, but before I begin, I am still fundraising for the LGBTQ Freedom Fund, which helps pay bail to secure the safety and liberty of individuals in jail and immigration detention. If that sounds like something you'd like to donate towards, I have a donation button below the stream. I have a donate command, exclamation point donate. My chatbot shares that command every 30 minutes. And when the stream screen comes up in the bottom left corner, I have a QR code that will also help you donate if that's how you want to do it that if you want to do it that way. Anyway, choose to do so is greatly appreciated. I don't see any money or any kickback of any kind from this. This just helps me focus on uh, doing what I do best, which is probably playing the game badly <laughs> and if you're if you are able and want to you can help either way you choose greatly appreciated and as always it's always really appreciated for you being here so now probably the worst part of all this was oh don't don't worry yourself i, I don't don't worry yourself at all i, I really appreciate you even being here it's great I, I really like that yeah, like the worst part was just getting the cap my capture card to not have like audio delay. <clears throat> Cause I think this is a Switch only game. Yeah, this is some of the games that me and my roommate have. <laughs> but yeah. Dragon Quest Treasures, let's go. I have not I have not even booted the game up. I like I get I got I got it last night and <laughs> was downloading it like while I was figuring out the audio delay. Oh my god, the little loading thing is Eric and Mia running. <laughs> These two characters from DQ eleven. This is like just kind of like a little side game for them to just be kids in. Yeah, adventure. <laughs> Man, Cryware has been around for a long fucking time. I think they were, they also did stuff for Symphonia, which is like 2004 or five. This game uses an autosave function. Great. Oh, I was expecting like an intro. Maybe it will be one after I press a button. Oh, hey, it's Yggdrasil. Eric. Oh, my look, God, little Eric is so adorable. Are you awake? 
So is little Mia. Let's sneak out again. I want to find some treasure. Treasure. We're going to be partying all night. They won't even know we've snuck off. <laughs> 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 I'll be up on the deck. And don't give the game away. Got it? Yeah. <clears throat> Do we get to actually control Eric? No, oh my god. Little stinky man. Oh. You can you can you can jump. It's me's notebook. Tales of Treasure is written on the cover. Me and Eric snuck out on the little boats again today, tonight. We found a cave, and inside was the prettiest stone I ever saw. It was a nice rock for sure, but I wouldn't call it treasure. We got a funny feeling that the next time we sneak off this ship, we'll find a proper treasure, the one we've been searching for. It's one of Mia's paintings. She's pinned it up here to cover the peephole. Everything is so big compared to Eric. It's a map of the world. Eric Reginald, the exciting places there are to discover. Oh yeah, it's Erdria. Nice. Uh, he he has always been the artist for these games. Tre is this the first treasure? It's a chest full of Viking treasure. Eric knows better than to try and open it. He said he looks forward to the day when he and Mia have treasure of their own. Yeah, the Vikings are probably tan our fucking hides. The Vikings must have brought this back from a raid at some point. It's a dragon skull. That's cool. Oh, oh. oh God. We got time to lie. Look, if it isn't young Eric, our very own little magpie. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> How long's it been since we took you and me on board? It must be a fair a fair old while already. Still, I bet you're glad we did though, eh? A steady job on a Viking longship? We must be the luckiest pair of orphans in the world. Hey. What was that? You're gonna find a treasure that'll make you rich enough to get off this ship? Ha. Yeah, how fat chance that tell me how much treasure you found so far? None. Sad. <laughs> of course not. Turn hunting is not for little runs like you. Leave it to the experts. As you can see, as you can see, we're having a feast here on here tonight. We don't want some scruffy young younglings spoiling the mood. Go back, so go back to your room and get some sleep because we cer because we certainly won't be. <laughs> you must have found some other way to get up onto the deck. Better try searching for another route, like crawling through a crawl space. What is it? Oh. It's one of the Vikings magazines. They say they only read them for the articles. Eric is a bit too young to appreciate such highbrow con- It's a fucking bunny girl magazine. <laughs> oh, Jesus. He just reads them for the articles. T right. Okay, yeah, it's L less stick to crouch. Makes sense. when I caught them. A funny little cat and pig, but with wings. Thought they were monsters at first, but they were tame enough. Must be rare, and you know what that means. Yeah, I'll drink. The voice acting is weird so far. It's like, for these random NPCs, it's kind of like the first like little bit of stuff is voiced. We're gonna be rich. So where are they now, then? Locked up somewhere safe, I hope. Oh, don't worry about that. They're in a cage and hanging from the mast. They're not going anywhere. Maybe don't do that one. Don't stand up and do that. The Vikings look. Well, the shelves are lined with books. The Vikings like to read them when they're not busy looting and pillaging. Eric can't make head nor tail of them, however. The little barb just kind of plucking away at the strings. That 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 
that sack king from the wall is like as big as Eric is. That's ridiculous. The size, the size stuff in this game is amazing. He's just a little guy. How'd she get past all these dudes? Do they even care? I mean, he seems like he's just absolutely blitzed already anyway, so maybe that's what, how. Alright, Mia. What's up, girl? <laughs> you took your time. I was beginning to think you wouldn't show. Just kidding, you know. I can't wait to find a treasure of our own. Those Vikings would never make fun of us again. Maybe tonight's night. Just imagine the look on their gormless faces if we brought back something really cool. Hold on. No one saw you sneak up here, did they? Uh... Are you serious? <laughs> well, never mind. They've probably forgotten about it already. What with all the excitement. But it's all ready. Maybe we can check out one of these little islands again. Huh? Creature. Glowing creature. Oink! Those must be the little strange creatures I heard the Vikings talking about. Poor little things. Come on. We can't just leave them locked up like that. Come on, let's set them free. We're not going to be able to climb up there, but I bet we can knock the cage down with these. What you got, kid? From your 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 empty po your pocket of, of dreams. Reefs 10 pebbles. A catapult pe pebble that inflicts very mi minor impact damage on a single enemy. ZR. Okay, so now we gotta... So yeah, this isn't exactly a JRPG, I don't think, but maybe, but let's. Alright, well, I guess let's shoot another. Oh. Creatures. Uh, um, yeah, they kind of just fell a pretty high. Distance and they're just little. They are small. Imagine being cooped up like that, left dangling from the mast. It's just horrible. They really are unusual, though. I've never seen anything like them before. Kitty. Piggy. <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh, haven't you noticed? You're free now. <sighs> meow, meow, meow. <clears throat> wow. Oink. <laughs> I get it. They want us to follow them. Maybe they're gonna reward us by showing us where all the good treasure is hidden. Well, there's no harm in dreaming, right? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Little guys, hi, Piggy. Why, you two? What's all this racket? What's going on? Let them out. Uh -oh. oh, here comes, here comes an angry Viking dude. It's not really a long ship. That's just like a ship that is long. <laughs> Vikings and and Dragon Quest are weird, I guess. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> that seem that doesn't seem intended. Let's go.
<clears throat> oh, to be a little piggy with wings. Sail towards the mist, they said. It'd be a good idea, they said. Um, since when was there an island around here? Is this a gate to another world? I mean, it kind of looks like that. <clears throat> Some ocean frogs, I guess. I'm looking, Mia. I'm looking. Okay, there, pro there probably isn't anything, like, on this island. Hmm. Mm, okay, fair enough. I guess I just inadvertently solved a puzzle. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh, simple puzzle mechanics. I get it. Oh, now we're playing as Mia! Alright, kiddo. Scoot. <laughs> the cobweb is bigger than she is! Spider's gonna eat good tonight, goddamn. <laughs> <clears throat> Do I have to, like, jump from... Oh! That may... I don't know if that's the intended way to get up here, but that's de definitely how I did. We did it. <clears throat> Look over there. Two of them. I smell treasure. I bet those are worth a fortune. And they just so happen to be the uh, societally accepted gender colors. Let's go get those daggers. There's two of them, so I make that one each. Oh, you can actually climb ledges, okay. That that didn't sound like an oink. Okay, that, that that sounded more that sounded more like a meow. Nice knife. Going to choose the boy all along anyway. Oh, there. Who even are you guys? 
<laughs> Little creatures. Are they gonna do like a fucking fusion dance? Ah, uh, close enough. <laughs> there goes the knife. The knife. You better go after him. You won't get rid of me that easily. That's sweet. Because normally in DQ11, Mia is turned to a statue for like a lot of the game until she gets cursed and a lot plot plot things. But so now there's they're doing adventures together. Thanks, Tutorial. Yes, I I know. Uh, there's no other tips. It's like next tip, the same tip. <laughs> uh. How quiet is our things? Oh my goodness! Look at these little lads. They're just taking a snooze. Oh my god. Seems fine, okay. Oh my, they're so cute. They're just honk shoo, me, 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 me. Honk shoo. God. Just blessed little creatures just snoozing away. The dagger me have found ruins is stuck firmly in the soil. Seems somehow to have traveled through the portal with her. Pull the dagger from the ground. It's like longer than her arm. <laughs> it's a dragon dagger. Oh, we're gonna gonna spec out some noobs in the fucking wilderness with that shit. Curious power seems to swell inside of her. Now, where could Eric have gone? Yeah, basically a fucking short sword. Yeah. I guess there is some RPG stuff. We have like HP and MP. Gate is firmly padlocked shut. There must be some way to get it op to open. Wow. Oh, hello, creature. Oh my god, you roll. You rolled. <laughs> JRPG light TM. The pink slime appears to be in a spot of bother. It wants treasure, me too. Treasure! She seems to be looking roughly round. She's look like, looking around agitatedly. It's almost as though she's looking for something. Could she have lost something and wants Mia to help find it? Squeesh. Uzabella. <laughs> I knew the I knew I knew there was gonna be a pun somewhere, but goddamn! Thanks, Isabella. Welcome to the to the party. <laughs> oh, uh oh. Oh God! <laughs> I will be your eyes. Mia saw where Isabella's lost property was located. It seems she has a vision showing her something that Isabella had seen. Could this have something to do with the dagger? Use the vision Mia just had to find Uzabella's lost item. It's probably like five feet away. 
When you get close to some hidden loot, your monsters will have treasure visions that show you where the valuables are located. To view treasure visions and cycle between them, hold L and press B. Compare the visions to the surrounding landscape and track down that treasure. Oh god. Okay, so there's like two big lily pads. Boing, boing, boing. Okay, so it's probably like over here somewhere, surely, right? Yeah. Oh, I have to hold it down. Slime Jewel. A sparkling gem, one of a kind, much sought after amongst slimes. This one is the prized possession of Uzabella. Me, <laughs> yeah, it has fun. Uzabella's treasured item. Slurpy little lass. Uzabella is absolutely delighted. Let me just keep that for later. It looks like she might well help me to get out, out by way of thanks. Over to the padlock gate with Uzabella. What are you gonna do? Turn into a key? Or are you just gonna, like, break it somehow? Isabella, over here! That... That's not... <laughs> Alright, whatever. We'll figure it out. <laughs> that's like a punk rock shadow monster. It's really cool. Jesus Christ, Isabella. Isabella has smashed the gate open. Whoa. Admiral Mogsworth is not going to be happy. Okay, bye. Not, a, not exactly how I expect us to get through this gate, but, you know, sometimes uh, you just kind of figure it out. And will not stop until every last bit of it belongs to us. When we are done with this place, not a single shiny scrap will be left unpillaged. Not a lick of loot unplundered. Who are we, you ask? Why, the most feared pirates of them all. Silver Bones Thunderous Plunders. Plunders. Plunderers. I can't talk. I oh. am Admiral Moxworth. Yeah. What is this theme song? It's kind of funky. <laughs> kind of like it, actually. Welcome to our crew. I've never been the one to ignore a damsel in, damsel in distress, so I locked you away in a cage. <laughs> Good question. There's one of my trusty crew and I have set up camp. From here we scour the pattern noggin for its precious treasures. I should explain that these islands are legendary for being absolutely chock full of treasure. We've traveled a long way to get here, and we're not planning on leaving before we've got our paws on every last bit of it. Quite like treasure. It's what we pirates live for. We, the thunderous plunderers, have selected this very spot to pitch camp where we strip the land of its riches. <laughs> Play your cards right, my girl, and I may even see fit to share a scrap of our spoils with you. Ha ha ha! You're a candy, yeah, he is a candy cat. I thought so. 
And there's a there's a ham the sham hat witch and apparently just a dude. <laughs> Me hasn't gotten hasn't got time to think about everything Admiral Mogsworth told her. She needs to find Eric. So you're like a, just a human person. Yahar! Welcome to our humble camp. Tis the base of all our pillaging upon the Paternoggin. And there's no rest for the wicked. Let me tell you, lassie, this island's packed to the gunnels with treasure. Tis a dream come true for lifelong looters like ourselves. Oh, it's a white priest. <laughs> I've asked. Captain Silverbone's first mates, Gustav and Bonnie, are currently discussing important matters. I can't let you in there, lastly, no matter how much of a shine old Maggie's taking you. Now, away with you! What slime is it? Oh, you little shit, I love you. They're just gonna be making slime puns the They're just gonna be making slime puns the entire time, aren't you? Admiral Mogsworth's newest recruit has woken up. This is seriously shady. We need to sound the alarm. What's, what's wrong with you, Shady? You just told him a minute ago. Thanks, Shambles. Sorry, right. I know I can be a bit dim sometimes. You look pretty bright to me. Now then, you're Admiral Mogsworth's new favorite, it seems. He's not usually so quick to take a shine to someone, you know? How you managed to wheedle your way into his affections while you were fast asleep is beyond me. Anyway. You're up and about now, it seems, and I have a sneaky suspicion you're planning to leave the camp, alright? I guess I am. I knew it. It's written all over your face. I, what? You've lost your brother? That's dark. Wish you, we could help you find him. But we're under strict orders from Admiral Mogsworth not to let you wander off. I, I love that... The, the shambles' hat is like opening to talk. That's amazing. If you're willing to help us out, perhaps we might consider our strict no leaving the camp policy. The other day, Shady buried some treasure around here to stop anyone else getting it. Then he promptly forgot where he put it, of course. If we could find that treasure and bring it to us, we might just consider letting you slip out of the camp. How is she meant to find it, shambles? We don't even know where it is. It's not really fair to. Of course it's not fair, you oaf. It's impossible. That's the whole point. We're not supposed to let her pass, remember? Ahem. <laughs> well, well, let's go over it all again, shall we? Shady's buried some treasure somewhere in the camp. Your job is to find it. Yeah, and if you do, we'll definitely let you through. No questions asked. Definitely for sure. Not a shade of shadow of a doubt. Honest. Well, aren't they fucking happy? The symbol of Uzabel is... Above Uzabella seems to indicate that she knows where Shady buried the treasure. It might be wise to keep an eye out for similar symbols in future. L let me be your eyes! Oh, that wrong L. Uh, in front of the podium. That's uh, not very hidden at all. Like, that's not a very good place to hide treasure. Like, right in, f like, right here. <laughs> Alright. Maybe, maybe Shady could have picked a better place to hide his, his special treasure. Oh, well, maybe not. Restless Heart. Accessory that ensures its wear and never falters in the face of adversity. Well, no, well, no, no wonder uh, Shady was trying to hide that because Shady is very um, scared. <laughs> so their dumbasses got it, yeah, <laughs> basically. I have to admit, I didn't think you'd manage it. This is a pleasant surprise. Now, if you're so kind, I do believe that Wrestle Heart belongs to us. Give me a hand. 
I, I don't know if hands is the correct word. I think we just got mugged. <laughs> by... Yeah, we just got mugged by the the, sh the sham hat witch or whatever whatever monster ver variety this is. Beautiful, isn't it? Seriously. <laughs> This is really brightened up my mood. We're hereby officially free to explore the big bad world outside. Off you go! Just because I'm feeling generous, you can have a handful of pebbles. Oh, oh gee. Map detailing part of Draconia, a legendary land that is teeming with treasure. It once belonged to a pair of peculiar pirates. And we got some pebbles. There are all sorts of wild monsters out there, so be careful. And don't say we didn't warn you. You got yourself a map. You can press minus to look at the big at the big map. Gullet Grove. Isabella, you have my heart. Ooh, we find some treasure already. What is this shit? Oh. Uh, I mean, I guess that counts. It's not like super. I mean, it's probably useful, but. It's... Ooh. Uh, let's maybe not look over the edge. Um, I'm gonna ignore the exclamation point for a minute and see if we can. Yeah. See if there's some treasure sequestered away on the corners, even if it's just more different pellets. <laughs> Sizz pellet. Okay. Okay. Well, so far this controls pretty well. I mean, it, I think this might be a Switch exclusive game. <laughs> Gooey gumdrops. I'm, I'm sure it is, Isabella, you beautiful bastard. Or, I'm sorry, beautiful bastard. Oh, monsters! Uh-oh. 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 Oh, the only good thing about Dragon Quest Two is its music. This is the battle track from it. <laughs> Oh no, this is this is a Dark Souls! No! <laughs> Not like this. <laughs> I thought so. There you are. My favorite little treasure hunter. I've been searching for you everywhere. It's the piggy! What's this? What's this? Trying to take on a Draki, are you? Oh. And we've got a monster to help you. A she slime! You may feel a little overwhelmed at first, but try not to worry. Every battle will make both you and your monsters stronger. Get him, Isabella! Fuck him up! Kick their ass! See what you and your monster friends have got. This is well worth knowing. The monster's like, oh yeah, this is how you fight. <laughs> monsters who join your gang will fight on their own accord when you engage battle. Work together and take your enemies down. Oh. I'll hit him from the back. Get him, Isabella. Kick his ass. All right, that's actually pretty fun. <laughs> Yay, we won.
Give the slime head pats. You motherfucker, do it. <laughs> you did it. But don't stop there. If you want to get started, you have to take part in plenty more battles. We're armor manners. We haven't been formally introduced. My name is Porcus. I'm searching for a very a certain very special sort of treasure. Drugs. Porcus. I do like these little like character like major character kind of introduction things they have. It's kind of cool. Reminds me of like the Smash Brothers like things. Still in possession of the dragon dagger. Those daggers are extremely powerful and will allow you to do all sorts of extraordinary things. For instance. A new challenger approaches. <laughs> But heal yourself, not bad, eh? What's more, when the power of two daggers are combined, well, wondrous things can happen. Hold on. What happened to the blue-haired boy who pulled out the other one? Uh, listen. What? You got separated and he's your brother, you say. Well, that's not good at all. But don't worry too much. He should have a new feline friend to keep him company. Still? We shouldn't let them on their own devices for too long. Let's see if we can't track them down. We're gonna fucking fight some more Drakis. Hope I think you can recruit monsters in this game too, which is part of the draw for me. Cause yeah, this is another track from Dragon Quest Two. This is like the overworld theme, kind of. It's the kitty. Yep, that's a candy cat. They don't normally stand up like that, and that's a slime. He looks so happy. If it is my newest recruit, what are you doing all the way out here? Is this an acquaintance of yours? He seems interesting. To answer your question, we are looking for Mia's brother. Is that right? I was up on the, the snouter horn when I saw him. A boy with blue hair and blue eyes. Blue hair, blue eyes, pronouns. Ugh. Typical. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Can't just stroll up to the snouter horn. There are all sorts of wild monsters hanging around. Can't a good conscience allow you to head in such a perilous place without a valiant bodyguard and guide? Which I mean me! Admiral Mogsor dresses like such a slut. I love him. <laughs> I like the, the open chest jacket, studded belt. Yeah, I like him. And we got Gunther. <laughs> of course, his name's Gunther. <laughs> we can use a skylift and force the top of this cliff to ascend, to this, ascend the snouter horn. Simply jump on a slime's back and use elasticity provided by their blobby body to bounce up to the top. This. Hold L and then press A, X, or Y to use a monster's forte. Work as a team to hunt the Oh, I love this. Monsters give you abilities. That's so good. Alright. Um, well, we, ob we obviously need to use uh, Uzabella. Oh my god. Yes. Um, anything else around here that I should uh, look for? That's awesome. <laughs> Gooey gumdrops! That's so good. I'm gonna have so much fun with this fucking game. Oh. I guess there's just treasure in the middle of the floor. Unappraised treasure. Yeah, I, I I really hope so, because so far it's awesome. It looks valuable. It's like you found some loot. It doesn't look especially valuable, though. <laughs> After everyone's like, whoa, it looks valuable, and Porky's is like, hmm, it doesn't look that valuable. <clears throat> you just pick up this common known as Bric-a-Brac. It may not qualify as top treasure, but you can find some equally rare pieces that are well worth adding to your collection. He has a train snout. Oh. 
Because we're just like... Oh, this is the Skylift platform. That is a big fucking door. <laughs> this is a big ass door, like... It's probably for like a giant. Or a cyclops or something. Skylift. Let's hop aboard and they'll whisk us to the summit of the Snatterhorn, where your brother surely awaits. <clears throat> what what slime is it? Jesus Christ. They're all just yelling their like one liners all the time. <laughs> Pull the lever, crunk! Treasure visions, yep. Hello, who are you? Two golden dragons. This is from a far off land. They who transform dreams into treasure. Oh, hello there. Speeding the legend behind the treasures found all over these islands. No thanks. I heard you monologuing just fine. Listen, have you seen my brother? And he would ha also have blue hair, blue eyes, and pronouns? <laughs> Best of luck. Oh my god, this bird has flight goggles. I love it. No, no doubt there is about it. I know a treasure hunter who I see one. Tell from your eyes, you see. It seems to have a little crew to help you out, too. Craw! Uh, thanks. What's inside? Pebbles. We have campfire. This is well worth knowing. Fire safety. <laughs> you can rest at a campfire to fully restore. If taking a beating, you need to recover, or your MP is running low. So you got the nearest campfire without delay. Oh, I'm pooped. I'm pooped. Yeah, I'm aware of that. Oh, property destruction, my favorite. Oh, I have to break dark. Oh, I smashed them like that. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, they're fucking this. Those Drakis up. Get him. Yay, level up. Man, if, this combat's pretty pretty good. I don't know if Dragon Quest, well, other than, like, games like, I think, Dr DQ Heroes or whatever, I don't think Dragon Quest has really done, like, like, live-action combat. Oh, also, there's the, the Dragon Quest MMO that never came to the States, I guess, but... I think this is the first time otherwise I've played a live, like, an actual, not turn-based Dragon Quest. Fuck him up! Sweet spank. <laughs> God damn, Mogsworth. You're fucking him out. <clears throat> mm. 
they're just rattling off their little one-liners the entire time. It's great. Um, It's like we're a little, well, I, maybe not us, but Mogsworth and the other two. Well, I, well, I guess they're, we're a part of the, oh, that's ominous. Is this a boss? Someone did say treasure. Yeah. I guess they really I guess they really expect me to be using pebbles a lot. Oh, I'm pooped. I think I've used like I've used like three. <laughs> I switch pellets again. I think at the uh, okay, spiky pellet. I would I would assume electricity would do good against this guy. Okay. And then... Okay, yeah, the, elect the electric pellets are very good. <laughs> that was cool. Great stuff. <laughs> Heartless because it's a robot. How cruel game. Admittedly, that ar and that enemy archetype kind of the uh, the head the hunter characters are um, just very aggressive. But I don't know it's hard, if it's heartless because it's a robot or if it's just a heartless robot. <laughs> hard to say. How cruel. Crimes crimes against cloudy nights people. <laughs> well, you made sure work of it at least. Now, someone needs your help. My dear boy, are you alright? Treasure. Crimes against androids. Mia, Where I've been looking everywhere for you. Listen. Hm. Never mind that. They found each other. Yay! Stinky kitty with bat wings. <laughs> Sleeping on a job again, Persola. Come on, up and at him. <laughs> Yeah, it's a very cute kitty. How dare you? Flapping feline, indeed. I have a name, you know. They call me Persula. Hey. 
Kitty. Ursula. Yep. That's a good name. <laughs> oh, it's an... I'm sh they're The slimes are just really happy to be alive. Where's the treasure? Uh oh. Where's something is? Moxworth. So Silver Bones' mangy, mangy dog's body wants to get his filthy paws on the treasure, does he? Well, not on my watch. Hand it over. Curse you! Levanter, no servant of Sylphania is going to give me orders. It's just was empty when we arrived, so stop acting dumb. It must be you who got your grubmits on its contents. They're just happy to be here. Yay! That tends to just kind of be the, the vibe that slimes have. They're just happy to exist and be wherever they happen to be. Uh, who did take it? <clears throat> Uh-oh. A, a different pirate crew. Oh wait, no, this this almost is almost certainly uh, the the group that we're part of. Maybe Bonnie, Gustav, Silverbones. <clears throat> I love his fucking outfit. Dude's got some fucking drip. It's silver balls. <laughs> We're late to the party once more, I see. We've secured the treasure. Whoa. It's one of the seven stones. Because of course there's seven of something. It's a dragon stone. Oh, bravo. Captain Silbones, you've done it again. No, not like this. Don't worry, Mogsworth. He can be part of our pirate crew. Isla Dorada. Gold Island or something? It will excuse us. Gar har har. Gar. Got a blast. <laughs> Hold on. I think that was one of it was snatched from right under our noses. Uh, sis? Piggy. Oh, you're a captain, huh? Gail. She's a little cutie. Where are the pirates? They're gone. 
Now then. You. What's your story? I'm there. <laughs> and this is my sister missing in action. Here, come here, eh? What are you doing here? Looking for treasure, are you? That's right. Thought as much. Well, best of luck to you. Well, it's good of you to keep us on our toes. I wish you luck. You'll need it. So. Are you part of a gang or are you hunting for treasure on your own? Well. It's nice to meet you. Later. I love the Draki with the little hat. <laughs> Now's a good time. Well, let's, uh, who's left with us? Looks like Gunther is just with us now. <clears throat> what slime is it? <laughs> She says it too. Was this a sky train? Oh yeah. Something else you want to show me, huh? Check it out. Islands floating. <sighs> Wonderful. I l I love islands floating in the sky. <laughs> Nice work, show me later, okay? I can't believe it. Oh. By the way. Now I take a closer look at your 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 knives. Shit. <laughs> Did that magically make the sky train work? Oh, it's the music from Dragon Quest Nine because you have a sky train in that game. Ah, sorry. Um, yeah. Yay, sky train. Somebody got the curious vehicle fired up and ready to go. We did. Huh? Look, it looks just like a dragon's head. Uh, that's kind of weird, right? <laughs> the place where we are standing is also shaped like a dragon's head. What? <clears throat> The trigger filled land where we find ourselves goes by the name of Draconia. It comprises two dragon heads as well as numerous other islands which make up the rest of their bodies. The story goes that two, two giant golden dragons chose this as their final resting place many, many centuries ago. Their enormous bodies slowly turned to stone, forming the landmass as we see below us now. Eric, I would not be sitting on that little fucking railing. With your back pointed towards the fucking abyss. That just gives me <laughs> mild anxiety thinking about that. Some some of them are very special indeed. The Dragonstones. Dragon Get down from there, child. Wow. There are seven super special treasures to track down. I like the sound of that. Absolutely. Great. That's the spirit. <clears throat> We're so pleased. Okay. Every last piece. 
Yeah, treasure. Great, I'll grab my stuff. <clears throat> that wouldn't be your doing my chance, would it? I guess so. Well, our daggers did the hard work. Wonderful. You know, I had this funny feeling that you might too might be the key to solving this world's myriad mysteries. Where are my manners? This is Winston. Princess I am. Oh no, she's hot! Princess and enemy of Sylvania. <laughs> Blue blood scholar, an enemy. Oh. So she's a princess, of course. Looks like one of your OCs. Hell yeah. Good taste. I guess that was just all the tutorial. Now I get another title screen? <laughs> Interesting. Oh, the loading thing changes them riding on the train. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Ugh. They just love life. <laughs> I'm feeling good. We should strive to be like them. Idea. I'm feeling goo. Uh, <clears throat> he's a little, he's a little uh, restless knight with like a pretty posh outfit. All, all considered. I need to hear your noises again. Do the train noise. <laughs> it's huge. All right, I've made him suffer enough. Good day to you. Am I right to thinking that you just arrived aboard that locomotive? Or would I be correct that you have somehow managed to get? Snouter Horn Station up and running again. Uh, I guess? Bravo. The company is saved. Houston's the name. Or for the Trans Draconic Railway. The railway is trans! Railway and fish. Aficionado. That's a grand total of three employees.
what do you mean? Your base, you say? What, what do you mean by that? Would you be so kind to enlighten me? By the way... Uh, can we have a quick word? In private? You too, Porcus. <laughs> <laughs> Friends have been kind enough to explain everything. I understand you came here in search of treasure, so I think it would be absolutely marvelous if you used our HQ as your base of operations. I said I thought, if you are to be based here, you should avail of the company facilities, well, those that remain at least. Just take a look around, I trust you'll find something you can make use of. Well, let's go see what facilities remain in this dumpy train station. Okay, can't go in there for now, I guess. Campfire. Don't think we really need to use that just yet. Oh, it's a gooey hand. What do you want, gooey hand? The name's Mudimer. Mudimer. It's a muddy hand. The name's Mudimer. Head of staff training. It's where our employees bed down and I keep them in check. I've had plenty of time on my uh, hand. Mr. Houston said... The one thing you are, you have plenty of time on it. Did he now? Well, it's a good job I've kept the place looking spick and span then, huh? Why? What are you doing? What are you doing with that? <laughs> okay, you can swap, uh, you can swap or, I guess, train monsters here. Okay. What about you, distinctly gender-colored... I'm Miss Cecily. Yep, I... Which way I'm personnel at the moment, so I must keep up appearances. Mr. Houston said... Can you make use of the facilities? I better explain a little more about how things work around here then, huh? Which means I deal with new recruits. We haven't had, had anyone get in touch in goodness knows how long. Oh, it seems like a new job application has just arrived. Seems that our candidate's a young Draki, and here's what they have to say. The truth is, I've been inspired by this amazing girl with bright blue eyes. She never gives up. I want to help her any way I can. Bright blue eyes, huh? Wow. So that's where we can get new monsters, it sounds like. Well, this place looks fucking trashed. <laughs> Been nosing around in here. Seems like some sort of storeroom. It's a complete pigsty at the moment. You'd think that'd be something a poor casino would be into, but. <laughs> yeah, I'm assuming that we can fix this place up by, like, doing missions or whatever. And... Or maybe it's something that just kind of happens eventually, I don't know, but. Yeah, this place is fucking wrecked. Fucking wrecked. We got any secret treasure hiding around the corner? Yeah, maybe. I honestly don't know. This is my first, literally first time playing the game today. I think this came out in like December. So in the grand scheme of like ga of gaming stuff, this is act pretty new. Yeah, it, it does sound like something that they would do in a game where you like collect stuff like this. It is like maybe some of the lesser treasures can be like crafting or ingredients or something. Surprise! Oh! <laughs> Can't sneak up on you, can we, Houston? Oh, I have a 
dream, you see, of restoring the company to its former glory. The Trans Draconic Railway crisscrossing these islands once again. Will you help me? Of course. Bravo. Break out the bunting. A lot of characters in Dragon Quest are, like, un inexplicably British. I don't know why, but they just kind of are. <laughs> okay, we got some, we got three, like, side quests. It's been these for a while, and Rebels have become quite, rather unsightly. Royal Soil. There's any royal sword you found on this one. You have to go to the Padronagon to get some. We need more manpower. I doubt you could do better than the orc. Those chaps are frightfully strong. I'm sure one of them would suffice. Now you may be wondering how you're going to persuade this orc to come and work for us. Well, I may be able to help you there. Buddy bullets! Slight so increase the likelihood of a monster wanting to join your gang. Effective against a single monster only. Good to know. In order to get a monster to join your gang, you'll need to defeat in battle first. Monsters who take a shine to you during the battle will come and visit you at your base once they've dusted themselves down. So I'm like, go. simply hit a promising looking orc with one of those projectiles and it's bound to take a shine to you. Give it a shot. Shoot, shoot. Is a substance known as sanguinite. That's what powers the entire railway, you see. I better had a room in a Sylphanian expedition is currently on the Paternoggin. It seems to have been in the possession of sanguinite, the very thing we need. The palatial plains. Will you help me? Great! Great! I'll grab my stuff! Just tag out. Bear this in mind. If there's a particular quest you want to tackle, select it in the menu and press A to send as a priority. This will display a marker that tells you exactly where to go next. Good to know. You can only have one objective at a time. Current objective. Yeah, that's they literally just told us that. Okay, so let's go back here and I, let's see if we can get that Draki or whatever. How can I help? <clears throat> Drang. This is worth remembering. Monsters who want to join your gang can be recruited from the reception desk. You have to pay their fee in order to do so, which is usually food or materials. Ah, okay. If the recruitment board, if the recruitment board is full and there are new potential recruits, the newest candidates will replace the oldest. Okay, so you you just want money. Have you decided? You're one of us now. Flap flap. <laughs> flap, flap. <laughs> Excellent. There there they are. Just flapping around. I'm sure they'll say some weird punny shit about flapping. Let's repair the railway for Mr. Houston. Patter Noggin. Alright, let's let's get into some ruckus. <laughs> See you later, guys. Take care of them. Curriculum Vitae. Time for Tom Fullery. Yup, yup. A towering flower that turns to face the sun. Used mainly for cooking. 
Yep, there's there's resource gathering and crafting in this game too, I guess. Oh my god, we can glide! Already well worth adding them to the team. Okay, I don't think there's anything else this way. Let's get some shut eye. So I don't know where you do the crafting at. Maybe we don't have enough stuff to do it yet. That's fine. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, get him! Fuck him up! Actually, can we do a buddy bullet? Oh! I think that means we got one that will, uh, maybe join us when we get, um... Fuck him up! Got him. Get him! Is there another one over here? Yeah. No, they're getting just dumpstered. <laughs> yeah, so far this game is delightful. And just how your little monster friends hopping around fighting things. Basically fought that one by myself. <laughs> yeah, I'd say so, because this is this is only ta like tangibly, like slightly related to um, DQ11 story-wise, because these these two characters are from Dragon Quest XI, like Mia and Eric. Other than that, no, no, it's just a just a just a game. What slime is it? <clears throat> what are you doing here, Mia? How did you get down here faster than I did? Well, I guess it doesn't want me to go that way. Do I go? Out th do I open this door, or can I open this door? Oh, I can. Okay. I was con uh, I was just concerned. Ooh, what do we have? Sainted Soma. He's mostly used for cooking. That's normally a pretty tedious thing to to make with alchemy, so. Luscious lettuce. Mmm, lettuce. Oh, we could just open this door too. Okay, well, great. Solar flowers. Where's the treasure? What's up here? Probably, well, there's something right there. There's the treasure. The whole climbing and, like, 
stuff aspect's not something I was expecting this game to have, so that's that's a nice bonus. Oh, hey, there's some royal soil. That's one of the things we needed, actually. Oh. This is the station place. Okay. Oh, well, let's go back down this way since it's kind of where we came from. <laughs> it's slime to go on an adventure. See if there's anything cool hiding around up here, since they've give they've given me way too much power in exploring this stuff. It it there's some treasure that's just up here in the building that you guys would not just come to find. Bang bullet. Well, that's cool. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this game. <laughs> Hmm. Any other goodies? Gotta go up to the top now. Gooey gum drops indeed, Isabella. We can also just glide from up here too, so we could probably just go straight over there, like immediately. <laughs> Perhaps maybe not do that and fall off the, the, the entire world. Uh. Oh, okay, we can't quite get up to that. We might be able to, if we're on the edge here, maybe we can get up here. Oh, sweet, we, we did. Oh, <laughs> they can barely fit up. <laughs> Gunther, no, it's not worth it. Okay, he figured he figures figured himself out. I don't I don't even care if there's anything up here. I was just like I just this is just cool that you can do this in this game. Uh can I can I go to the top top top? Okay, that's probably about as high as I can go. That's fine by me. Probably not anything up here. Except for a fucking nice view. And Drang's beautiful face. <laughs> um, well, one of the things is down there. Let's see how far uh, Drang can take us. Oh, he, oh no, he's got a stamina bar. This isn't going to end well. Abort! <laughs> Abort! <laughs> We're not... It, yeah, it's, it's it's like an open world dragon. Well, most of them are. A lot of them since, uh... Well, 8 was an open world game, in the sense that you kind of just explored the map. I mean, I guess a lot of dragon quests are like that in that case, but, like... I guess it depends on what your concept of overworld is. Uh, open world, rather. Metal power. One of the mysterious metals that can be equipped to provide a useful power up to you or your monsters. You found a Draki mo This is worth remembering. Equip metals to give you and your monsters a power boost. Every metal is different, so use them to balance out your Oh no, don't do this to me. Make me have to like
I guess it's just kind of this game's version of like equipment is these medals. Hmm. Was there other stuff I was seeing? Yeah, it was this one down here. Oh, so. That was, I, I should have, I could have expected there would be, you know, fall damage, but. Oh. An oomph pellet. Nice. Gooey gumdrops! Now can I combine Fortes? Oh no, the wind! No, the wind's blowing me away! <laughs> Rude! Oh, yeah, that's the, that's the re recharge. Ooh, critical hit! Slime drop. Used in cooking. Slime, it's time to cook! Get him! Fuck him up! Yay! Drang's level 5! Ooh. Royal soil, huh? Ooh, muddy hand. Let's fucking... Let's fuck him up! Oh no! <laughs> Densinium. Used to make pellets. Okay. Sh we already have shadows. Ooh. Bones! I like bones! Princely powder. Delicate dust. Delicious. I'm guessing at some point it'll probably be worth it, worth our time uh, getting rid of one of the slimes for someone else. The, 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 the extra... Ooh. Purple gem? Okay. Not that I want to, but like, it might be a, it might be worth having another set of a, another ability to use. We probably don't need two slime bounces. Although maybe that could be useful because there's like maybe a cooldown. Funny bone. Of course. It tickles monsters pink. I wonder if the owner used funny bones to make uh, buddy pellets. Treasure. Frizz. Frizz pellets. That's a fire. That's probably a fire elemental uh, pellet. It's a sham hat, which we have to. We have to. It's, it's sucks to suck. 
Try aiming a little bit better next time. Succulent stone. Oh no, we, we're gonna eat it. <laughs> I'm jelly happy indeed. I'm just kind of running around exploring everything. I'm not even like... Act well, while they're doing that, I'll do this, I guess. Because they don't need my help. <laughs> they just murdered the damn thing without me even like participating. Now I'm just wandering around collecting little things. And my monster's just roughing things up. Oh, there's an orc. We're gonna have to try to buddy pellet that one. Oh, well, I might have to help with this one. There's a, f a few of these. If you defeat a monster and successfully succeed in scouting it, be sure to talk to Miss Cecily at the personnel desk. All the potential candidates can be recruited from here. Supreme steak. Oh no. So now we just need this sanguinite. What are you eating? Well, whatever it was, it wasn't good enough. So over there is probably where the sanguinite is, but I'm exploring. Did all the work, earned it. <laughs> they, they, they were fighting that one while I wasn't even paying attention and I just get the last hit. Yep, all me. <laughs> Wondrous wheat. Clobbering these little monsters out here. Oh, that's a big crit. Got him. We're just gonna, like, just destroy everything on our way. Pick up all this luscious lettuce. Gooey gumdrops. <laughs> we gotta go. Well, fine. Oh, I actually got hit. <laughs> they avenged me though. Because they're good monsters. Mushroom! Unfungus. <laughs> Spores induce sadness. Well, I guess that'd be why it's unfun. Damn it, Isabella.
Uh, okay. Can I heal my, my monsters? I guess not. That's okay. I'm jelly happy indeed. Ooh, restless armor. Well, something I can like, like drop down and like attack it, like. Tough nut. I feel like if I swim in this, yeah, it's gonna like try to drift me away. Glimmergrass. That's a got a glor go a gorgeous glow. The whole gang's here. <laughs> Alright, it's this dude. I know you, snort grunt. <clears throat> I am Captain Lavanta. <coughs> Excuse me. Drink some more coffee while this guy gets his monologue in. He's got like a little mustache and then he's got his horns. His face is, is busy. Expect me to believe that. Got any sanguinite? Stuff's pretty worthless as treasure goes. Picked up some of our travels as it happens, but we got our eyes on bigger prizes. If you got some, tell us where it is. At least he's not mean. Oh, we can heal here. Let's get some shut eye. Oh, kitty. Kitty. Oh, how I miss dear old Sylvania. A girl can't even treat herself to a hot bathroom in these parts. A hot bath? Oh, you never had one? You poor neglected little urchin. Jeez. Um, 
you fill a, a tub with water that happens to be hot. <clears throat> and you soak in it. Then look out for peeping toms. <laughs> Of course, the child will be way up here on the ship. Oh, she's got her own little Draki friend. She's very unusual. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake with cooking ass, yeah. Ariel. Ariel the Draki. Oh yes, I'm adopting her. Oh, let's fucking go. Let's fucking go, child. I'm gonna beat this. I'm gonna beat you so hard your strawberry sauce is gonna go everywhere. <laughs> I'm gonna beat the strawberry shortcake out of this little bitch. <laughs> If you can do a battle against a rival treasure hunting gang, put, put that, pull their flag out of the ground to clinch victory. Well, um, ah, okay. Oh, well, you know what? Fine. I, I'll, I guess we'll just fight. I'll just kill y'all. Dang, long range frizz. Psych. It was all a fucking bait. Okay, I think we can re remove the flag now. Ooh, what's this? Well, I guess we should probably remove the flag now that we've murdered all of the monsters. Flag is like way bigger than Eric is. <laughs> we win. Gosh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's tiny. Wow. Dagger power, go! <laughs> wish I could do that. It's like, uh, I wish I could find some snacks. And then just go into, like, d detective vision and just find some, some snacks. Good 
good to know. By selling B tactic the fortune finder. The needle will point you to the nearest to the general direction of the nearest treasures. Head that way. Oh, I can I can deactivate it. Well, they're just having a great time, aren't they? Where could that be? Not too far. Take off. I like to sweep. Where could that be? Not too far. Is it on the map, maybe? Okay. I don't really know where to go, but we're gonna, I don't know, wander around and use this thing. Try to get some luscious lettuce, that is. Mm. And some shrooms. Okay, so it's off in this direction now. Don't knock me in the river. <laughs> Not like this. Is worth remembering. <laughs> when there's treasure nearby, your monsters let you know using treasure chest icons. The icon will become more striking as you get closer. Watch how your monsters react and use the fortune finder to pinpoint the precise location. Uh, they keep spawning in the water. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> That's amazing. Nectar. Delicious. Sparkly sap. Drops. 
No. Oh, it's right here. Descriptive. <laughs> Go away, treasure. Go away, treasure. Some... His vision's black and white. <laughs> Get, get good there. Oh, we leveled up. So now our little dagger does more damage. God, they, they sound so silly. Oh, here's one of them. They're so enthusiastic about treasure, it's really infectious. I love it. We found some treasure. Sanguinate. Oh hey, that's one that's the thing we needed. Are you gonna give me zoom? Oh wait, there's the Yep. It's the wind stream. Oh, oh my god, they're just have they're just Wee! <laughs> That's amazing. What? I love this fucking game. I guess so. Good to know. Yeah, that's what I was trying to glide towards that unknowingly and um Don't you hit me! Ooh, 44, nice.
What a beautiful place. Here we go. Just, just, just freaking, he just hear freaking uh, Gunther in the background. Gooey cup drops. <laughs> He's just yelling at the top of his little gooey lungs. This game is delightful. remembering about speak to the character let him know there you go thank you very much very good I say thank you very much very good Cause I have to actually <laughs> So we gotta go, go uh, recruit the orc. Welcome to personnel. We 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 got a few people. Some applications came in. <clears throat> we don't have whatever that is. Hoggles, Grimes. Uh, I think I like Slamma better as a name. Come meet the gang. Oh. <laughs> I love you both, but I think I like Isabella more than Gunther. Bear this in mind. This is worth remembering. Oh, nice. So, old uh, orc here will let us scan for consumables. That's cool. I think the orc has already very well introduced themselves. <laughs> Anything to report? Are you making progress? You could say that. Boy. Oh, we lose Slamo. Well, all right, bye. I have another one at least. That's okay. We'll go get the other one out. Ah, the door I wasn't able to open earlier. Well, let's go recruit the other uh, orc that I got. I don't think I did buddy bolt on two of them. How can I help? But I have two. Here are the candidates. Let's see. 
You want nectar. Have you decided? Glad to have you on board. <laughs> Excellent. <clears throat> Have you decided? We need monsters like you. <laughs> <laughs> what a goober. I love them. Excellent. <clears throat> Have you decided? You're one of us now. I'll wash my hands. You only have one hand, and you're never gonna wash it because you're you're you are mud. Excellent. It's like I am speed. Have you decided? You'll be a great asset. Abracadabra. <laughs> they they gave the monsters so much personality. It's, it's awesome. I love that. Excellent. Uh, we only well we already have a slime, so. Yeah, um, we don't have whatever this, you don't quite have enough. uh, Rice Blossom. Alright, cool. Alright, let's continue. Shadow, and yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. We're... We have to talk to him again now, don't we? <clears throat> nope, fine. Whatever. I was I was expecting him to stay over by the door, but he he's a spooky little guy. Yeah. Now it's unlocked. I can now access the cellar. Well, let's go fuck some shit up. Make some new buddies. In the cellar. Cellar buddies. What are you doing, Mia? Oh, seven dragon stones. It's no way, there's no way that's not what that is. I wonder where it could be. Maybe the big fuck off chest. Well, that was simple. So same blue color as your eyes. Oh. What a kawinky dink. Hang on. Stone tablet. <clears throat> Dragon's tail lies lost, hidden amongst countless other treasures. The lapis tail, one of the seven stones. No doubt about it. Yay, tablet. Look. Check this shit out. Whoa. Well, it's the thing I was just talking about how I was getting no way it wasn't like related to the dragon stones. What would this curious chart be? Look at that. It says cloud compass. The way to La Isla Dorada. Huh? Let's see what it says. Oh, excuse me. The amber glints in a giant's horn. The sapphire shines in an ancient one's eye. The amethyst awaits in a gargantuan maw. This emerald swoops past on the dead king's wing. The lapis lies in a snowy tail. 
Citrine is sharpened by cutting winds. The ruby lies at the heart of all things. Uh... Right. Let's not get distracted. We got important company business. Uh oh. <laughs> we got a banner to deliver. Show me. Well, it's a wondrous sight. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Gunther, you're not in the party anymore, but hey, he's having a good time. Silverbones lot, but there's a whole host of other treasure hunters to contend with. Hmm. Frank, I fear you don't have the manpower or resources to compete. Hmm. Let's start upping our game. Don't worry, I've been killing everything on sight. I'm feeling goo. Any ideas, Eric? Uh, I mean, I'm fine with Team Treasure. I was put on the spot, I couldn't think. Go see what Porcus has been up to. Ah, there you are. So what's this verdict? I think a new vault is rather splendid. Just fill it with treasure. I think I missed what he said. Oh, well, yeah, we have this thing. It was the, uh... I've never seen this before. Slime Jewel. Hey, we got a new treasure. <laughs> Kicked in Castle Wall. One of the walls from Zemokzva Castle that has been kicked down and repaired several times over. Huh. Cool. Right. 
I guess so. Oh, I suppose. You know. Then I'm going to change the trope place there to view information about it. <clears throat> hmm. All right. Well, I guess we got to go find some treasure. Let's talk to you. See what you're up to. Oh, that's how you swap monsters around. Okay. What a fine collection. Jolly good show. This is worth remembering. Okay, so yeah, we want to find treasure to... Increase the valuation so that we can, um, okay, that's done. So we can ra raise our gang levels so we can do more things. Not so fast. <clears throat> no doubt. Aww. And we did we did the last bit with Eric. Let's do let's do the last bit of the stream today with uh All right, then. with Mia. It's my turn now. Bear this in mind. It's your favorite swap burglar. Choice is yours. Right. Come on. Let the hunt begin. Yeah. Doo -doo. <laughs> Can I undertake all sorts of different quests? This is useful stuff. Really restorative rice balls. Guess we'll go to the mainland, whatever that means. Are you paying attention? You can check your golden ratio for each island to from the station's destination list. The higher value means your monsters will be able to sense treasure more easily, so be sure to head to islands with higher numbers. Okay, so having a different team can uh, make it to where you um, find treasure e more easily. Eh, it's good enough. I was gonna go to the main lane anyway. Although that one, th this place has the highest compatibility currently, but that's fine. We'll go to the main lane because that's kind of where I said I was gonna go. See you guys later. Now all I use HP at zero. Take them out, taking them out. I should use the drugs to revive them. Welcome to Bone Dry Heights Station. This is well worth knowing. And heading for the exclamation point is a good idea. And they're already like, ooh, treasure. Bone dry heights once the train stopped coming. The 
Ben Baker. <clears throat> Will you do as I ask? No. Sweet Shade Glade and Hot Breath Halt. the ground level it's just taking that lift over there are you paying attention or no I'm not paying attention I'm just thinking about treasure and monsters emerald masu okay fist cup fist mushroom Warmer, warmer, hot. <laughs> Next to a cactus. Uh, <laughs> like how they see di they see things differently based on like just what they are. So next to a cactus. A ball cactus next to a smaller cactus, so it's probably like over here somewhere. Oh, it's right there. Well, that was quick. We already found some treasure. A fan. Budding spud. Want it chipped or chopped? Are you an item shop? Pebbles, pellets, heal pellets. Okay, that's a, I might buy some of those. There's damage types. Buddy pellets are expensive. Okay, you can buy pellets and just materials. But I got some healing pellets. So if somebody gets a little, little hurt, we'll be able to heal them up. Marble slime. Oh, here's the Dragon Quest 3, like... Overworld music starting up. Greasy palm. Don't spank Isabella. I mean, she might be into that, but you should ask first. 
You don't just spank people without asking. That's weird. <laughs> Gooey gumdrops. Oh. Ham Shamwich. There's a f quite a few enemies over here. Oh, hey, well, yeah, you don't have to use the pellet thingies to recruit people. That one just kind of joined on its own. Oh, this greasy, nasty hand wants to fight. Come here, nasty hand. Let's go. Oh, my, did my orc friend just do fire breath? Where's... Where'd they go? Are they like running away? What's going on? Hmm, I should definitely be walking in this tar pit. Uh, I can't jump in the tar, makes sense. Gross hand. Come here, stinky. Uh, let's test out some of these uh, healing pellets. Good enough. A little cumbersome to do that, but probably useful to have. Get juked. Fucking blasted away while getting the level up music. It's slime to murder. Ooh. His armor enemies are a little stronger. Sweet. Near a spine, huh? Yeah, it's pretty close. I think this deserted armor is kind of probably guarding it. Yeah, it is. Ah! 
Dang, <laughs> Orc just running around destroying everything. Treasure! It's gotta be worth a fortune! This is well worth knowing. Ah! Where's the treasure? Where's the treasure? This is useful stuff. Okay, so I can carry six treasures or seven. I can't count. <laughs> I look at it and say the, the wrong number, and I'm like, oh, yep, total. is actually fine. Okay. There you go. <laughs> He's just blah. Just got some stuff laying over here. Oh, I got put to sleep. I got snoozed. I got heckin' snoozed. Doonberry. So there's a airstream. Like right here. Oh. This is well worth knowing. There's proper treasure. And then bric -back. We should have picked up anything value you come across. Can't use the fortune finder to locate bric -back, but your monsters will react to it. Look for blue treasure chest icons and check your minimap. Yeah. Oh, it's not even up here. It's down there. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Whoa, cool! Thinkinson's, nice. Oh, they're asleep because it's night time. Oh, Rice Blossom, okay. Those are what we need to recruit the uh, Restless Armor.
sweet spank. Well, they didn't stand a chance. Come here, you, um... No burning breath for you. Oh, sweet breath. I mean, that's sleep. Let's speak to that monster later. Oh, I guess we kind of scouted that wall, just, just keel in it. Colossal cactus. Doesn't look that colossal, but hey, you know what? Okay, th this way. Me a vision. Um, near a pillar, it looks like. Um, uh, let's see. Uh, what a baby up here, maybe? Did they mean these pillars? Oh, they they did. All right. Well, we're finding lots of treasure. In a very short amount of time. It's gotta be worth a fortune. It's a sward. Oh, we gotta we gotta land immediately. No, no. Okay, now I didn't take as much as I thought I was going to. Ooh, looks like I'm gonna need to probably use some pellets for this one. That was a lot of XP. <laughs> Perhaps I should use something a little bit better than a bang pellet. That didn't seem like it did much. Maybe a sizz pellet will do a bit more. Much more. Yeah, that's the stuff right there. A lot of XP. Fairy fluff. Sweet. <laughs> you can keep your spear, bud. I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just going. <laughs> Suspicious. Okay. Scorpio. 
Lord's turret. Oh my god, look at the Drakis up! some pretty strong drackies. I'm gonna go bat. Well, makes sense. I, it feels like I'm in an area I probably am not meant to be quite yet, but... But thanks to these uh, Sizz pellets that I have, I can do some pretty good damage. Oh, I ran out of this plus. Guess we better try something else. Looks like I'm gonna be buying a lot of pellets <laughs> until I can learn how to make them. Level twenty. That, that seems like a bad idea to, to to pick a fight with. I don't suppose I can like fast travel, can I? Treasure forecast, change island, on info, current location, back, zoom. Hmm. Yeah, it feels like we're probably, level-wise, we probably shouldn't be here. Not without getting more Sizz pellets, though, because those are doing good damage, it looked like. <laughs> Me too. Station down there. Let's see how far the game will let me go. I mean, it's got all these little stepping bits. See, so yeah, I like it's, it's like was designed for us to come out this far, even though it's kind of a little far out. have up here doing berries doing berries She got up there. Not me. Yeah. Oh. I'm just trying to see how high I can go at this point. And not, hopefully not run into like some like level like 40 monster or something. Because like that would be bad. Probably. I think. It's 
Sorry. You can do it. Surely there's like something up here. Can we walk on this? Uh, probably not. <laughs> I'm full of surprises. About to be full of bruises for me just falling from like a million miles up. Woo! It's pretty high up. Oh, is that a? Is there is something up here. Okay. It's hoping for maybe a little more, but we'll grab this and we'll grab that, and then we'll probably head back to the station since we got some treasure and such. What's inside? A whoosh bomb formula. Ooh. Are you paying attention? The recipes will expand the menu at Ches Blanc Mange. A new formula will add pellets to the works. All that's left for you to do is find the materials. Recipes and formulae can be bought in shops or at stations. It can also be found in wooden chests you find lying around. Be sure to bring any you find to Ches Blancmange or the works. I don't know what either of those are. I don't. I, I don't think. <laughs> I think we found th that before we found out how to actually craft things. <laughs> I thought you maybe you made them at uh, campfires, but that does appear not to be the case. Swoop. What a delightful little game. Grab this stuff here and then we'll head down to the station there. Ooh, an orange gem. Nice. Ooh, sneaky, sneaky. You can do it. I see that box down there. Ooh, didn't even take fall damage. Oh. Oh, ten of them, okay. That's a little better. Let's see, materials. Can we not? Oh, we. Uh, the cis pellets are light damage. Okay. They are expensive, it looks like. <laughs> Adderall. <laughs> they sell Adderall pellets. <laughs> Let's see, Zam. Oh, okay. If you hold down, if you hold down A, it'll do uh, multiples of like. I'm gonna buy a lot of those because those seemed really helpful for fighting uh, those uh, bigger monsters that we didn't have much business dealing damage to. But on that note, let's head back to the station. What do you got to say for yourself? I shadowed Mr. Baker. For you. Of course, you shadowed him. 
I shouted at Mr. Baker for years as his loyal sidekick, you know. I was delighted to learn that the company was getting back on its feet. It's, a, it's an honor and a delight. They make a lot of light puns, so delight is fitting for them to say. Yeah, I, I'm, I, I, I can see myself having a lot of fun with this game. I already have. Should we get that treasure appraised? What a delight! What a delightful game! Gang warfare, <laughs> of course. Back at last. This is exciting. What treasure could it be? Is it like a steel fan? I've never a, seen a, one of those before. A, sla a slap, so oh. a steel fan that's so heavy you'd be hot. You'll, you'll be hotter trying to cool yourself with it than not. <laughs> it's just like an assassin's dagger, maybe. Oh, uh, poison needle. Close. Close enough. Oh, that's worth a lot. Oh, and the, wow. it's a platypunk statue. And is that like Erdrick sword? Mudrick sword. I'm sorry, Mudrick. A soiled sword that leaves makey mud on whatever it cuts. Well, interesting. That's all. We just we just like more. We just like tripled the amount of treasure we have. <laughs> Went from like three hundred something k to like one point four million gold. I have to get an appraised freak and learn its name and how much it's worth. If you find a treasure that's already in your collection, you only get to keep that one that's in better condition. Oh, oh, now they're worth more because we turned in more treasures at a time. Okay. Very good. <clears throat> ah. So we can use Chimera Wings to get back quick. Mutual Busy work. Satisfying. You can, have, you can have dispatch monsters, whatever that means. Yeah, I said monsters on dispatch missions. Speak to Mr. Mudimer and he'll help you organize your monsters and send them all over Draconia. So our, ne our next uh, goal is four million, which frankly doesn't seem that hard. We just gotta find more treasures. Okay, so Eric goes on the expeditions. Thanks, Mr. Mudimer. You uncanny fucking weird hand. <laughs> the treasure forecast has changed. Let's see what we got. You can send teams of monsters all around Draconia to hunt for loot. If their golden ratio is high enough and luck is on your side, they'll not just come back with materials, but also with actual treasure. Mm. 
<clears throat> Who are you sending? <laughs> Thanks for slurping right in my ear, Gunther. I don't know what the significance of all these things are, but where do you want to go? This place seems to have the highest ratio for our uh, our people. Are you sure? Mission length fifteen minutes. All right, cool. Well, we're not. It's gonna. Well, we'll be able to check that at some time next stream. Next stream, because there's not 15 minutes left. <laughs> I have something new to offer you. Thirsty. Monster has heard about the gang at this point and has applied to join. Okay, you want whatever that is. Oh, you're you're willing to join us, Oozwald? Of course. You need something that we don't have yet, because of course. Oh, we can get you. We've got an important job for you. Great joins the game. Excellent. Have you decided? <laughs> Let's be friends. Oh, you're huge. You are massive. <laughs> this is like a differently colored uh, shadow character, which frankly for Dragon Quest has always been the case. Like they've all they've been doing the palette swaps things for monsters since the first game. So. Excellent. Neat. Uh, well, we can't afford Thirsty yet. We don't have enough sparkly sap. That would be easy to get, though, if we had more time. <laughs> this stuff wouldn't be hard, either. You're like a gold star monster. <laughs> oh, Oilesis. <laughs> That's a really good monster name. Chaos Berry. Um... Oh, Centerback Ridge and Hinterquarters. So we haven't been to those places yet, so that makes sense why we haven't found those. Quarters is uh, buzz berries, spicy berries. Ooh. You are a hand. Quests, medals. We have a, we have like a slime medal that gives more HP. Probably not a bad one for me to have. Because I can imagine if I if Mia or your main character bites bites the dust, it's uh, not a good thing. Hmm. Well, I think we'll, we'll save and we'll call the stream here. What a what a delightful time! I'm so I'm so glad I uh, that they made this. It's, an, it's a fun little side game. 
gives me something to play until um, eventually they might release the uh, the Octopath Traveler engine uh, remake of Dragon Quest 3, which I've been waiting for for a while now for them to do. Alright, so I think it's saved. This is useful stuff. Oh, that lets you return to the base, but if you have treasure, it'll, like, lose it. Load. Okay. Subtitles, yes. Sound. Boy, oh, nice. I don't have any I don't have any qualms of playing it in Japanese or English, but English is what it's already on, so that's what I can read, so Yeah. We'll make a manual save too, just just in case. Alright, cool. Alright. Oh. Fun times. Fun game. I'm looking forward to playing more of that. Uh Maybe not next month. No, not next Monday. Next Monday. Next, like, next week. Other than, yeah, next week we're uh, not going to be streaming. Except maybe Saturday. Because I'll be doing work stuff on uh, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. And probably Wednesday. If I'm not doing anything Wednesday, maybe we might stream then. But, yeah. Anyway. Let me put the thingy up. Thank you, everyone, for hanging out while I played some Dragon Quest Treasures. Especially you, Cloudy. Thank you for being here. I appreciate your company. Um, let's see. Let's see if we can find somebody to raid. Let's see what we got. Who's live? Uh... Mm. Well, we can we can raid into our good friend our our well, I don't want to say good friend because I'm not super close, but their friend. Ooh, thirty two viewers, nice. It uh, looks like uh, Lucian Latre is doing a subathon. So let's pop in and see how things are going. So I'm mean, in my stream. I'm gonna raiding into Lucian or Lucian Latre, English slash French. So. Yay! <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna end my stream. We'll raid, in, we'll raid into them. See you there, folks.